welcome to the weekly update. My name is Gary and today I will be your host. Today in this program, we will talk about computer-based national examination and how naturalistic learners prepare for it. Before we move on to the main topic, first, let's take a look at what we call as 8 multiple intelligences. In 1983, Dr. Howard Gardner proposed a theory about eight multiple intelligences. He thought that the standard IQ test wasn't good enough. Those eight multiple intelligences are visual spatial, logical mathematical, interpersonal, intrapersonal, musical, kinesthetic, linguistic, and naturalistic. Surveys are a method of gathering information from individuals. Survey may be co conducted to gather information through a printed questionnaire in many ways. In class 9C, the survey is conducted using close-ended questions. After conducting multiple intelligences checklist in ni class 9C, here is the result. So, an interview is a formal meeting between two people where questions are asked by the interviewer to obtain information, qualities, attitudes, wishes, and etc. from the interviewee. Do you prefer studying outdoors or indoors? Outdoors. Why? Because it's fun. Do you explore the environment to find children and teach them to prepare for exams? Do you feel motivated to learn when seeing natural things such as plants, sky, animals? Yes. Why? Because the way of life. It's right there. When you're bored at studying, do you look at natural things such as plants, sky, animals to rejuvenate so that you can study more? Yes, I do. Why? Because when I see the natural things, it, it makes me feel happy. That's all. Does the environment have an impact to your academic life? I think no. Studying outdoors or indoors? Outdoors. Why? Because <coughs> seeing natural, natural things can make you start study faster. Do you explore the environment to find certain answers when preparing for exam? Yes. Do you feel motivated to learn when seeing natural things, such as plants, sky, animals, and why? Yes. Natural things have motivated me to learn. When you're bored in study, do you look at natural things to rejuvenate it and study more? Yes. Why? Uh, because I love seeing natural things. Does the environment have an impact to your academic life? Yes. If so, why? Uh, it makes me study faster and it makes me easier to memorize. Okay, thank you very much. You're welcome. Do you prefer studying outdoors or indoors? Outdoors. Why? Because it makes me feel more relaxed. I can study better. Do you explore the environment to find your answers when preparing for exam? No. Do you feel motivated to learn when seeing natural things? Yes. As I said before, I feel more relaxed. When you're bored and studying, do you look at natural things to rejuvenate so you can study more? Can you repeat that question? When you're bored at study, do you look at natural things to rejuvenate so you can study more? No. Why? Because it doesn't help me. Does the environment have an impact to your academic life? No. Okay, thank you very much. In 1965 until 1972, the name Ujian National was changed into the name Ujian National. The name is not the only thing that changed. How the exam is done is also changed. The 
questions for many national languages. In, and in 1972 and 1979, the national exam was erased, so the quality of education in Indonesia, in Indonesia was below than 40%. In, 19, in the 1980s, Indonesia tried to enhance the quality of education in Indonesia, so Eptanas was born. In 2001 until 2004, the name changed into Ujia Nasional. And in 2015, the national exam didn't determine whether the students will pass the national exam or not. The school will to decide whether they graduate or not. But the system is now more sophisticated because it is computer computer based. According to, and according to the data, no no students here on a national exam, so this the system is really good. What was your graduation like? I was studying, but I never miss. I can share myself to not miss a single thing. How did how did you feel during the test? Uh, I was nervous, but then I really. Um, what was the result of your test? I got two, nine, and one eight. So, what are your suggestions for your junior for the upcoming computer based exam this year and next year? I suggest that the junior high must take and prepare for the exam now. Start to come. Okay, thank you. What was your preparation like? Well, I studied some of the previous lessons from my teacher, doing some practices, questions that has mentioned the material of the class. How did you feel during the test? Well, mostly I feel great not at first, but in the end I feel anxious, panic, and feeling that I can't do it. So what was the result? Well, the result was very satisfying. I got mostly of my scores 9 and it was very satisfying. So what are your suggestions for your junior to the upcoming computer based so uh, exam? My suggestions for the upcoming junior for doing us uh, study more, doing some practices from your teachers and ask questions if you are having difficulty and mostly listen to your teacher. Okay, thank you very much. for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and God bless.